Water is a chemical substance that has two hydrogen atoms joined to a single oxygen atom. On Earth, water exists in various forms that include vapor, ice, and liquid. Found in seawater, icebergs, glaciers, and rivers. In the past, civilizations have flourished around abundant, life-sustaining water bodies. The society of Mesopotamia grew around the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, and ancient Egypt and Nubia around the Nile River. Water is fundamental to health and essential to every cell and organ in the body. Water is also vital to the livelihoods of children, women, and men, supporting food security and economic growth. For a well-organized ecosystem, a never-ending water cycle is critical. And for sustainable development, balanced management of this valuable resource is essential. While abundant in many places around the world, drought, climate change, and poor management lead to water scarcity in many areas of the African continent. Home to thundering river valleys, Sub-Saharan Africa is home to many of the world's most critical water challenges. It is unfortunate that in the midst of abundant natural resources, many Africans are thirsty and have poor health due to poor sanitation. More than 300 million people living in African countries lack access to safe drinking water, and more than 500 million lack access to improved sanitation. Every year, 800,000 African children die from diarrhea. That's one child every 20 seconds. In many rural areas of Africa, women and children walk long distances to collect water, leaving them vulnerable to various outside forces. As society moves forward to address the water crisis in Africa, it is important to understand that water is a geologic climactic issue. Water is an agricultural livelihood issue. Water is an environmental justice issue. Water is an economic development issue. And water is a geopolitical security issue. Those without access to clean water and working sanitation cannot live on potential. No will is good without action. Let's unite with a greater sense of urgency to tackle the water challenges that so many people in Africa and other regions throughout the world face.